Hello YouTube, welcome back to the Smart Thrifty and Chic channel. Coming to you with another Dollar Tree haul. This item I'm showing you are sweet potato and duck meat sticks by Natural Value. It says it's 100% all natural treats and they're tested in the USA. The next item I'm showing you are Sargent's Canine Prime Munchy Chews. There are 20 chews in this particular package and they are rawhide, that's bacon flavored. So I picked it up for my four-legged friend. And last but not least, for my pet, we picked up a package of sausages in a blanket, beef and cheese flavor, made in the USA. This is a four and a half ounce package. Moving on to people treats, I picked up a package of Charm Sweet Pops. Uh, there are seven pops in here, and they're another treat that took me back to my school days was this 18-pack of Double Bubble Gum. This is the Fruitastic flavor, so it features apple, grape, and watermelon. In the sweet treats category, I picked up this package of Rainbow Twizzlers, and it features strawberry, orange, lemonade, blue raspberry, grape, and watermelon flavors. Two kids' items. I picked up this very cool spiral art uh, toy back when I was a kid and you just put a pen or a pencil and you take it around and it makes these great geometric shapes so I thought that would be fun for my daughter to do. Also for her I was very excited when I saw this Yo Gabba Gabba book. Um, it's titled It's Nice to Be Nice. Sorry about the glare. Um, for those of you who have kids or don't have kids Yo Gabba Gabba is a program that's on Nick Jr. It's really popular it features um, magical creatures, so that's Broby, Fufa, DJ Lance. It's a very popular show, and the pages, if you've ever seen the show, look like um, scenes directly from the show, like they just took stills and made the book. So I'm very excited because my daughter loves this show, and to find the book for a dollar is a great deal. So keep your eye out for that. Another item that I saw that I hadn't seen before at my Dollar Tree are these Color Your Own mini books and they feature 19 8.5 by 11 inch cards and the cards have the child fill in different things that they about themselves. For instance, this one says I like to and then your child fills it in and then colors it like I like to read, I like to play, I like to sing whatever it is. So I thought this would be a great activity for her to do and that would also reinforce um, her writing and coloring. So great fun. I found this Disney Princess, uh, it's a sticker book and stickers. It, and what I really like about the stickers, sorry about the glare, is that they're really large size. So the Cinderella, the sticker starts up there and goes all the way down there. So we've got Belle, Ariel, Cinderella. Continuing with the princess theme, I found this Disney um, princess sticker book. And again, the nice thing about the sticker book is that the stickers are quite large. So she'll be able to have some fun with these. And it also has little hearts and a glass slipper and a basket. So very, very cute. So a great find. Another sticker album I found with stickers was this Mickey, Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. So here is the sticker book and then here are the stickers. They have a holographic background but they have Mickey, Minnie, um, Donald, Goofy, and she loves to watch the show so I thought this again a great activity. She can take the stickers, put them in the sticker book, and create her own little stories. And going along with that idea of creating a story using stickers, um, they had these sticker scenes, and it features a background. So this particular background features grass, trees, and whatnot, and there's a whole bunch of stickers that go along with it. So in this case, there's a squirrel, a butterfly, a ladybug, a snail, and what the kids do is that they take the stickers and they put them against the background, 
and create their own little scene. So it's called, uh, this particular scene is called Life Above and Below, and the, ch the child gets to put the stickers where they would belong in the scene. So a great way to have fun, and then again, stimulate the imagination and the thinking skills. So I thought this would be great that she can do, and that one is a dinosaur album, and it features a brontosaurus, a tyrannosaurus, triceratops. So again, a fun activity that we can do together. On to stationary items. I found these great little uh, notebooks. They contain 80 ruled sheets. They look like they're leather, they're not really leather. And they have a little hook, and the sheets are lined. And I love the stitching, so I picked up one in every pattern that they had. So this is a black with white stitching. This is black and pink, again, featuring a white stitching. And last but not least, we have the tan and brown. And again, it features 80 ruled sheets, and the sheets are three and a half by five and 5.7 inches. So this is great little something to throw in your backpack or your purse to keep track of notes or to do. I also was excited to find this notebook. Um, it's a hardcover, and it contains, again, 80 ruled sheets. These are five by seven size sheets. They're ruled and then it contains this elastic so if you want to keep any receipts or documents in here you can slide them in under the cover or between the pages and then use this to hold it tight or if you want to reference a certain page in the notebook you can use this to do that as well this next item I just picked up because I fell in love with the design it features two memo books and that what I really liked about them is this orange background with this beautiful silver design going around it and of course the pretty gemstones. These have 60 sheets in each one um, and what's really nice about it is that the little cover that comes across this has is a magnet in it so it holds it shut. I have really been impressed with the, the journals and notebooks that Dollar Tree has been getting. This journal is beautiful for the spring and summer and it features flowers and a beautiful little bumblebee and this contains 60 ruled sheets five by seven inches <clears throat> and similarly this is another journal that contains 60 five by seven sheets this one is in a nautical theme to use with my journals and my little notebooks I picked up this three pack of ballpoint pens they all write in black ink. And something else to use when I'm writing in my journals is this beautiful ballpoint pen that's encrusted with fuchsia, light pink, and clear crystals. It's a ballpoint pen that writes in black. I know this is not new to Dollar Tree. Um, some people were hauling this pen in February for Valentine's Day. My Dollar Tree just got them. So I'm very excited to pick it up. These next items were a repurchase for me. I picked up the Couture tape. Each uh, package contains two dispensers and the dispensers contain tape that's half an inch by 360 inches in length. And you can see I've got the striped and I guess the spheres, the colored spheres. And I love this one, which is the Paisley with the psychedelic print. Broke down and actually purchased my very first, uh, I guess you guys call it washi tape. And it's the multicolor polka dots. So I'm very excited to see uh, how I'm super excited that I finally found the purse hangers. So there were two different designs. Pretty one that's uh, blues and purples. More of a flower motif. So I picked up those. I was super excited that I finally found these little manicure sets that are in the flip-flop or um, thong as some people are calling them. And if you open it up, it 
It has a little um, file, cuticle pusher, clippers, and little scissors. So very cute, something very easy to throw in the purse. So I picked up one in every color. So there's a pink sandal, green sandal, and a blue sandal. So I was really excited to find them. I also picked up one of these Halsa manicure sets. I found some really cute, sassy and chic fashion nails that I picked up. I have yet to try these, but I've seen a lot of um, YouTubers hauling them, and I've seen some videos on how to use them, so I'm hoping that I can figure out how to do it and get some pretty nails going. So this is the Greek key style. Then this is kind of an ombre style going from a light pink to a dark pink. And this is really pretty. It looks kind of like a um, plain nail with a little accent of a flower on the corner. Her um, ombre and it features um, glitter on the nails, sparkle. A black and white houndstooth pattern gold and black animal print and this really pretty like bright bright chrome color um, I don't know why but the nails on this particular set seem to be significantly longer than any of the other sets if you take a look of course I picked up the nail glue so that I found the Revlon nail polish now this one features a web on the cap, and I think some people were saying that it's part of the Spider-Man collection. And this uh, blue is called Super Powered. This, this gold, bright gold with the glitter, also, sorry for the glare, features the web pattern, and this one is titled 1000 Volts. Here's a pretty, it's kind of a pink and blue shimmery coming off purple on the screen but it's actually more of a pink with uh, blue speckles and this one's called Gwen's Crush and last but not least I found some Revlon that are not part of the Spider-Man collection but they kind of have a weird texture to them. This one's called Star Attractions, and it's kind of a green. The bright blue called Rock Chic, and it has some, it says leather, so I wonder if it's going to have a matte a black with green um, sparkles. It's called Elusive. And here's kind of a neutral color, and it's called Graceful. And here's a beautiful pink with sparkles, and it's called Tahitian Coast. Our Sally Hansen Extreme Wear Nail Polish, Hard as Nails, and it says Matte Effect. And it's a beautiful red, and I can't see a color on it. This is color 920 Wax Poetic, and it's like a deep red. Number 980, Blue Blood. Number 970, Family Jewels, and it features blue and silver glitter. Number 910, Rogue Red, featuring red and silver sparkles. Number 950, Court Jest, featuring blue and green glitter sparkles. 940, Chain Mail, and this is a matte black. Now this is just says Sally Hansen, hard as nails. And this is number 320, Love Rocks. It's a beautiful pink. 420 
Mighty Mango, number 960, Royal Shyness. And again, these have a matte effect. I picked up this really cute makeup cosmetic bag, and it has a cute little handle. They had different colors. I picked up the pink and white, but I know they had a lime green as well. I picked up one of the Sassy and Chic Kabuki brushes. There's been mixed reviews. I picked up the Wet n Wild Brow and Eyeliner Pencils. The first one is C649 in Mink Brown. And the other one is in C655 Charcoal. I also picked up the Maybelline uh, Great Lash Mascara. This one is in Green Envy and it says it's a limited edition. And I also picked up one in Icy Blue. Unfortunately, the Icy Blue was not in the full packaging, but it wasn't opened. I picked up um, two of the LA Colors Lipstick Duos. So it features a lipstick and a lip gloss. This first color that I'm showing you is called uh, Flushed. And this next color I'm showing you is called Pleasure. Continuing with the LA Colors, I picked up a liquid eyeliner and this is in black. I also picked up an LA, uh, I believe it's LA Colors mascara in very black. I picked up this Colormates lipstick and lip liner pencil in the color Light Berry Frost. I found one of the L'Oreal Rouge Pulp lip liners, and this is kind of a brown liner. I found the L'Oreal Illumination Loose Eye Color with Blush. This is uh, 115 Aurora, Aurora Halo. And number 215, which is a pretty purpley blue in blue. I guess the color's called Blue Sky. I picked up one of these Sassy and Chic Beauty Benefit Creams, and it is in the medium color. They had a lot of pale as well. If you're, I picked up two of the Diamond Cosmetics eyeliners, one in black and one in medium brown. I picked up three Maybelline Color Tattoo eyeshadows. One is in a blue, the middle one is in a beautiful dark purple, and the one on the right is a neutral color, kind of a beige. I picked up one of the Sassy and Chic um, makeup blenders. I was really excited to find the little um, compact mirrors with the crystals. So I picked up one in each design, the I Love You, the lips, and the animal print. Here are the Chap Ice lip treatments, which are basically uh, dupes of the Vaseline treatments. I picked up one in each uh, flavor. We have original, cocoa butter, and rosy. Three flavors of the lip balms. These are watermelon, strawberry, and cherry. And each one is 0.14 ounces. I had never seen this before. It is Lily Blossom Lip Gloss, and it says lightly scented. It doesn't say that what the scent is, but I'm excited to give it a try. Eat lip balms. I picked up one in every flavor I saw. So what I'm showing you now are peach, watermelon, bubblegum,
strawberry, orange, and grape. I picked up this De La Ritz and it says hair building fibers, make hair thick instantly, natural fibers, washable, no color. So if you see in the picture, here's a person with thinning hair. They add some of this to the top of their hair and comb it out and their hair looks thicker and fuller. This was something new that I'd seen at Dollar Tree too. It's called a Quick Root Touch-Up Pen. Perfect cover-up for roots. It's 0.12 ounces and it's called Hide Your Gray. So I picked up one in Jet Black for myself and one in Medium Brown for a friend. Hair Mascara, which as you can see, before the before picture it shows where you can see some grays where the hair is grown out and the after picture shows no grays. I saw this pure and natural rosemary and mint shampoo hypoallergenic paraben free. It is 227 grams or eight fluid ounces. It smells divine and what's interesting about it is that it is made in the USA. So I picked up the shampoo and the matching conditioner. One of the White Rain Boutique Collection Gentle Facial Scrubs and I also found one of the facial cleansers slash makeup removers. Each one is four ounces and they're by White Rain. Uh, facial items. This is a facial mask. It cleans and conditions. It has vitamin E and lavender oil. It is 5.5 one ounces. The middle one is a facial scrub so it exfoliates. It's enriched with vitamin E and apricot extract and you're supposed to use this to clean and condition. Again 5.1 ounces and this last one is a facial wash enriched with vitamin E and green tea and they all smell really nice and I believe they're by Greenbrier. I also picked up this new pore facial scrub. It says for skin with acne and compare to Neutrogena Acne Stoat. So I picked up the oil free acne wash. It has salicylic acid. It's acne treatment. It's eight fluid ounces. And the acne body wash that's enriched with aloe vera. It contains salicylic acid. Acne treatment for clearer, cleaner skin and it helps to find fight body acne. I picked up the Body Raves Rush Less Play More uh, Pink Passion Foot Scrub and to go along with that I picked up the Rush Less Play More uh, Blue Chill Foot Lotion. I also found this Tea Tree Oil Foot Lotion this one is seven ounces. It smells really nice. And then the matching tea tree oil foot scrub, again, seven ounces. I picked up one package of the Max Block After Sun uh, Aloe Vera Cream. This is uh, six ounces. I picked up one container of the Dermacil Advanced Treatment Creamy Lotion. I up one complete set of the April bath and shower uh, rose scented uh, shower gel lotion and scented body wash. The April bath and showers peach and white orchid items. I picked up the shower gel and the body splash. I picked up this two pack of zest uh, Lush Paradise Soap. I picked out this 20 fluid ounce um, bottle of Claire and Danver antibacterial liquid hand soap with glycerin as a moisturizer and it's antibacterial. Soft clean scent. I picked up one package of the shell shaped bath fizzers in pink. I picked up this beautiful purple goodie uh, Hair clip, it's limited edition, and it's just got the little bar that goes on the back. 
I also found a pretty little goodie uh, flower clip in this teal color. In the seasonal section, I found this three pack of hair clips featuring this beautiful bright yellow and orange flower, a white and blue flower, and then a beautiful lime green. The middle flower is a little claw clip. The top one is one of the little um, hair combs that you can just stick in. And then the bottom one is just like a slide on, slide off clip. I picked up this other package that features a lavender and white, a beautiful bright orange, and a blue and white flower. Same concept, the middle clip, the orange one in this case, features a claw clip. The top is a comb and the bottom is just a little slide where you I found these beautiful frames that feature crystals and then they each hold a four by six uh, photo so the first one that I picked up is covered with beautiful dark purple crystals the next one I picked up has a kind of a rainbow effect of different colors orange yellows reds purples And the last one I picked up, sorry for the glare, features pink, a border of pink crystals on the top and the bottom. Well, I found this beautiful little owl that's pink and green and purple. It's a little piggy bank. So I thought this would be a great little accent for my daughter's room. For his garage, I saw this cute sign and it's so true as it pertains to my husband it says dad's tools rules don't touch them don't move them don't borrow them don't even look at them the note card section I found this eight pack of note cards they retail for 325 each that's a black and white floral pattern and it's blank on the inside so you can use them to write any kind of notes and I fell in love with this I finally found the mini wallets each one holds 20 cards. It says great for credit cards, pictures, photo IDs, money, business cards, and receipts. And they slide open. So I picked up one in every pattern that I saw. So this one is white and it features flowers, butterflies, and polka dots. This next one has a kind of a teal background and it features a big butterfly and flowers. Here we've got rainbow kind of like zebra stripes and here is a white one with a more ornate floral background I picked up this beautiful Mason Atelier unscented uh, candle it's a beautiful dark blue it is 2.75 inches by 5.9 inches and look here folks this retailed for $14 what a great find at the Dollar Tree. So I picked up two of those. Laundry aisle, I picked up this Gain fabric uh, softener sheets. There's 20 sheets in this particular pack. I picked up this two pack of screen protectors for the iPhone 6. Found the Gala bags that everyone was talking about. Um, they featured a little clip on the back. And then they have a Velcro enclosure. And they also have a cord if you want to tie it around it to hang it around your neck. And I picked up one in every design that I saw. So this is a kind of a light gray slash background with flowers in teal, gray, and white. There's this pretty green with a yellow flower, red one with a flower, lime green with a flower. This is a light gray, a denim, an army colored denim, a black and a white denim. I was super, super excited to find these. I found the makeup bags by Sassy and Chic. 
So here is the lipstick bag in pink. The lips bag in black. And the flower bag with the bright pink background. I picked up one pack of these kids wipes, 60 count, and what's interesting about these is that these are flush friendly, meaning you can flush them in your toilet if you want to. I picked up one of these jars with the chalkboard style top, it's a mason or canning jar I should say. A nice size. All right. Thank you guys so much for your patience. I'm finally done with the haul. As always, feel free to comment. If you want to see more videos, like and subscribe. Thanks so much. Have a great evening. Bye guys.